Hey guys, welcome to your love reading for Virgo. This is going to be for your second half of your August from the 16th to 31st. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. We are going to take a look and see uh, what is going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on. Apply this to your own unique situations. Switch to rose if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um, Virgo people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So tell me about Virgo. What is going on with Virgo in love and the person that they are connecting with for the second half of their August from the 16th to 31st? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Virgo. So we have a strength card here, Leo energy, and we also have the Emperor here, Aries energy. Okay. We have the Six of Cups and the Own Kang. Someone here is feeling very lonely without you here. Someone here is missing you a lot. Yeah. The thing is, I feel like one of the things I'm feeling like someone here is like really holding back, trying not to communicate with you, trying not to reach out to you here. But someone here is sitting in silence here, missing you here. Feeling lonely without you. Ace of Cups and the Empress. Look at that. Libra Taurus here. Whoever this is, this person cannot stop thinking about you here. This person is thinking about you nonstop. We have a strength card here and the Ace of Swords. The four, uh, not the four, the Emperor. Oh shoot. Hold on, that's too many. Tell about the Emperor here. Why is the Emperor here? The Emperor and the Five of Swords here. This person's definitely playing a bit of mind games with themselves here. You know, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like the reason why that you guys separated is that you guys couldn't resolve your issues, resolve your conflict here. You know, I do feel like this person could have gaslit you. This person could have manipulated you here, okay? Trying to get ahead, trying to get, uh, 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 trying to like win at all costs here with the Six of Cups and the Queen of Cups, with the Five of Pentacles here and the Knight of Cups. This person ideally really wants to come back towards you here. You've turned your back on this individual emotionally here, uh, Virgo. And I just feel like, yeah, I just feel like this person just cannot stop thinking about you. With the Ace of Cups here and Nine of Cups, they see you as a wish fulfillment. They see a life here with you. They see growth and expansion here with you. This person just cannot stop thinking about you. This person just feels very, their heart is weighing very heavily here for you, basically. Okay, what else do we have here for Virgo? The person that Virgo is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Virgo? Six of Pentacles here in the Two of Wands. The Fool in the Knight of Pentacles. The Fool. Aries energy in the Knight of Pentacles. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. King of Wands and the Hangman, Piscean energy. This is your person here. I feel like they're unable to let you go here. I mean, it could be a situation that this person was giving energy towards somebody else. And, you know, they could be realizing it. They just, they just didn't compare to you. Yeah, they just didn't compare to you. There was a lack of equal give and take in the situation here. This person was confused, dealing with other options here. This person was indecisive. And now this person's hung up on you. This person's unable to let you go. This person's, yeah, this person's unable to let you go. We have the Nine of Pentacles, pre-Empress energy, uh, pre-Empress energy, Virgo energy here.
They really truly want to work on things here and work on manifesting this relationship back together here. They realize that what they had with you here was really, really good. Yeah, what they had with you, it was really, really, really good. And this person could be realizing that they made some mistakes here. Some mistakes, I get mistakes, yeah, mistakes. Not some, but mistakes, okay? What else do we have here for Virgo? What else does Virgo need to know? Look out for, work on, for August. Second half of August from the 16th to the 31st. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Virgo. Page of Cups and the Five of Wands. Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Five of Wands here. Judgment and the Queen of Wands. We have the King to Queen of Wands. We have the Emperor to the Empress here. <coughs> Excuse me. And the Six of Swords and the Three of Cups. It does seem like someone here is coming back with an apology to reconcile, but you're turning your back on the situation here with the moon. Cancer, Pisces, Energy, and the Page of Cups. We have the Ten of Cups. This person's definitely trying everything that they can to fight for this relationship. Why is the moon here? Yeah, this person, like I said, I feel like, you know, you are very weighing very heavily on their heart space at this time here. The Judgment card and the Nine of Wands. This person is taking responsibility that they've hurt you, okay? Queen of Wands here and Knight of Wands here. I mean, you could be running away from the situation here like a free bird. Yeah, running away like a thief in the night here. I, you know, I feel like you're trying to, some of you guys could be trying to get away from this individual. But I feel like this person does, does have intentions of coming back around to apologize because this person's in, the deep, in deep regret here. This person wants to reconcile. They want to rebuild this connection here, okay? So let's say if this person walked away from you towards another option, this person wants to come back around. And yeah, this person sees a future here with you or that they don't see a way forward without you. And they don't want you to leave. They don't want you to move on from them here, uh, Virgo. Yeah, they, they, so I feel like this person basically wants you back here, okay? Yeah, I feel like they're trying to do everything that they can to fix things, to make things work here, to work together as a team with you. But, you know, I do feel like, you know, you could be in this energy of like, you know, you could be done with this here. I mean, I would say some of you guys could be done with this. Some of you guys could be it could be entertaining this here. What will happen to Virgo entertain this? What will happen to Virgo entertain this? Eight of Wands here. There will be resolution here. There will be a sense of moving forward here. Okay. Yeah, I, I see that you guys might have a conversation here, you know, and talk. Yeah, kind of like see what happens here. Yeah, they do want to heal the connection here. They want to do everything that they can to keep this together and start this new beginning here. So it's really up to you whether you want to take this on or not because at the end of the day, Virgo, you have free will to choose what you want to do and what's right for you, right? So Virgo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.